meditation channel. Close your eyes. Sit or lie in a comfortable position. Give yourself permission to do something different today. To love yourself more than you have ever before. To heal through stillness. Through awareness. And to step up, to be a little kinder, a little more aware. Scan your body. Just notice if there is any discomfort, pain, stiffness. And if there is, you can either place your hand on that part of your body and send it some white light. You can just visualize white light from the palm of your hand into that part of your body. Visualize the healing, your cells regenerating themselves. You can even ask that part of your body what do you need from me today? How can I make it better? You can release your hands. Bringing your whole focus and attention inwards, releasing your surroundings. And now we're going to think about the heart. Take a moment to think of something that might be bringing emotional discomfort in your life. Just one simple thing. I'm sure there are many. <laughs> but try to focus on one main issue. And if you are not quite sure what that may be, that's okay. Just allow your intuition and yourself to guide you there. And if it helps, you can place your hand on your heart once more. Channel that white light inside your heart. And you can ask it, what do I need to heal right now in my life that is causing me pain and discomfort? You'd be amazed at how your body, your intuition will tell you. But you have to listen. Sometimes it takes time to learn how to listen. And that's absolutely fine. And whatever that emotion, maybe you just get a feeling, arises, consciously channel that white light into it, into your heart, into that pain. 
And once you reach it, ask yourself, ask the pain. What are you trying to tell me? What do you need from me today? What words do I need to change in myself? How can I speak to myself better to serve you? to elevate you and to heal you. What actions do I need to change in my life to serve you, to heal you, and to make you better. If you didn't get anything, that's absolutely fine. It will come to you. But the practice alone will heal you. And that is more than enough. So just continue some of this healing, allowing that white light to go into that wound in your heart, that pain, soothing it, listening to it, feeling it. It's important to acknowledge the pain that we feel. Don't hold on to it, but you need to feel it. That's why the pain is there. It wants to be heard. It needs your attention. Don't be afraid of it. Now that we heard it, now that we gave it love and compassion, you can let it go. Once more, you can release your hands. Knowing that we have done some physical healing and some emotional healing. And now let's focus on ourselves, our whole being, mind, body and spirit. I want you to think of one thing that you do every day that does not serve you. This could be a habit, this could be a mindset, this could be the way you speak to yourself or the way that you speak to others one thing and if you're not quite sure just ask yourself what is the one thing that is not serving me on a spiritual mental emotional level that I need to change right now And place your hands now on your stomach. Both your hands like you're almost hugging yourself. And once more, channel that energy into you. But this time, watch this energy totally take over every part of you from head to toe. Like you're giving yourself an energetic hug. An energetic healing. An energetic upgrade and now as you think about that one thing that is causing issues ask yourself why do I do it where did you begin was it something from childhood is it a protective mechanism that you have created over time This may be a small thing or this may be a major thing. 
And even though today we may not solve it, today we're one step closer to solving it. Now that you can think of that thing, ask yourself, why are you here and what is your purpose? What are you trying to protect me, shield me from? If it's a fear or a threat, ask yourself, is that something of the present or is that something from your past? Is it serving me today? Can I be more selective of when I choose to use it as opposed to it using me? If you had some answers, that's great. But now we're going to do some shifts with affirmations. And we're going to speak to it and release it. Continuing to hug yourself and creating that white light all over you. Say, Thank you for shielding me, protecting me. But I no longer need your service. I am strong and powerful enough and I am ready to make some changes in myself. I am ready to become more aware and I am ready to walk in my power. I trust that I am strong enough, I am wise enough and I am open enough to listen, to learn to grow and so I let you go with love with gratitude I am no longer that broken child that wounded soldier I am a warrior I am powerful I am perfect whole and complete the way I am and I am here to learn and grow And I no longer allow the wounds of my past to dictate my present. I choose my present. I choose better for myself every day. And I am strong enough to make the changes. Breathe it in and breathe it out. Shift the fear into power. You can rest your hands now once more and allowing all that healing and energy and that love that you gave to yourself to shift and move around you. Take a moment really to appreciate that you spent these 10 minutes, 15 minutes, sitting in stillness, giving yourself the love and the healing and the empowering message that you needed to hear for today. Carry this message throughout your day. Walk in your truth, in your power, knowing full well that you are enough You have all the tools you need to succeed. And that these emotions and wounds are there to teach you, to make you stronger, to make you better, to make you wiser. But they do not have to dictate your present any longer. Because we have let them go. We have grown from them. We have become wiser and stronger.
We are perfect, whole and complete, just the way we are. Breathe in and breathe out and just expand your awareness back into your body, back into the room. Take your time and when you are ready, you can gently open your eyes.